The Monday film returns to BBC One next week with the memory of Eva Riker, a blocked memory which holds the vital clue to a string of murders aboard a luxury ocean liner sunk at sea. Natalie Wood heads the cast, and that's at 9.25 next Monday night. Evening entertainment for Tuesday on One starts at 6.40 with more adventures for the captain and crew in Star Trek. Here, here, Captain Robert. We're just barely in range, I've got to warn. At 7.30, more fun and comedy in the Little and Large show. In Taxi at 5 past 8, Tony takes on extra work. I'm changing my life. I'm getting tired of driving a cab. So what's the new job? I'm going to be a chauffeur. At 8.30, tough competition as the British and American teams continue on their rescue mission. Real Lives at 9.25 investigates the plight of families forced to stay in some of London's seedier hotels. At 10 past 10, Match of the Day features highlights from the day's play at Wimbledon. At 10 past 11, David Copperfield performs extraordinary feats of magic and illusion. Programs for Tuesday evening on One. And now, match of the day from Wimbledon. Today, Wimbledon celebrated the centenary of the First Ladies' event here with a parade of famous champions. It's 60 years since Kitty Godfrey won the first of her two singles championships, and tonight we'll hear from the sprightly 88-year-old who's still playing the game. The current men's champion, John McEnroe, gave further notice of just how difficult he'll be to dislodge. He allowed today's opponent, Bill Scanlon, the number 14 seed, just seven games. McEnroe winning eight in a row at one stage. Also tonight, the Paul Anacone story. I better repeat that, the Paul Anacone story. He's one match away from doing a young McEnroe. And in the Battle of the Blondes, Miss Carlson of Sweden does it again. She's now in the last eight after beating Andrea Tenishvari, the number 15 seed. Hello, good evening. Tonight, we've got a great men's match for you with Ivan Lendl, the number two seed, taking on the new young star from America, Scott Davis. But fittingly, on this day of celebration for the ladies here, we'll begin with them. Now, Joe Jury, seeded 10, was up against the youngest girl in the championship, 15-year-old Steffi Graf of West Germany. The prize, of course, a place in the quarterfinals. As we join it, Jury has already served for the match in the deciding set, and now has another chance at 6-5. Virginia Wade and Gerald Williams were on centre court. 